Mark Fuller Oodles. Thank you for tuning in again with us today. I've been seeing here recently different reviews and mentions of the different pack out kits that different companies have. You know, DeWalt, Milwaukee, Craftsman. But one that I picked up, and I've had it for over a year, and it's a very good, sturdy toolbox system, is the rigid toolbox system. Now this is the, this one here is the, what they call the Pro Gear uh, 22 inch cart toolbox, because it has the wheels on it. Very heavy duty wheels, robust, roll over uneven ground, easily. It's got the extendable handle. And like I said, it rolls very easily, very well got these nice wire hooks on both sides and on this particular box the whole lid comes off and well, I've got some tools and stuff in here but anyway I usually use this box for when I'm going on different you know doing different jobs that I need to certain tools on I'll stick all my power tools in here mostly my bigger items because it's a big open area got this little storage tray down here in the back. Uh, but it's for the most part, it's just an open box. And it's great for sticking in just any kind of power tools. That's where I usually keep my saws all, drills, and stuff like that if I'm going to do a particular project. All right. Okay, it's got these big, nice, heavy wire latches on the side. It's got the ability to lock it here. It had a little bar that slides in the top here that you can lock the next piece on with, but. I didn't care for it so I have removed it and it's got a very heavy duty handle you can pick the whole box up by that handle and it's not going anywhere as you can see I'm sitting on this other one and I'm not you know uh, I'm not a light fella and these are really heavy duty boxes and you can you know stand on them and they don't give it all so I really I like that about them you know if you need to reach something on the a little higher up off the floor. So next, let's, let's talk about this one next. This one here is what they call the rigid 22 inch organizer. And let me show you here on the side how these snap together real easy. They just snap together on both sides like that. And now, you know, it will come off. So anyway, this is the rigid organizer. Again, has the locking hole there for a padlock. The nice wire latches. Now, this one, it came with one of these dividers here. Can you get a little closer? Mm -hmm, you can see it. One of these dividers here on both sides. slides in there they have one for both sides and it had six of these three on each side okay it had six of these little cubbies and again they call it the organizer but I don't use it that way so I actually took the little cubbies out I leave one of the dividers in here because I usually put my power tool batteries in here uh, I'm a big uh, I have a big collection of the Ryobi actually power tools, but I know this is a rigid box, but I have a big collection of the Ryobi stuff and I Put all my Ryobi 18 volt batteries in this one. This is where I transport them in And again the boxes have a seal so they are weatherproof Nice good box there and actually if you have these in here um, When the lid closes down it matches up so you know nothing is gonna go you know, go from container to the container if you have these containers with stuff in them. I do like that, but that's not what I decided to use it for. And I might, I thought about picking me up another one of these just to use it for the organizational properties of it. All right, and this one is like they call the organizer. If you want to. This one's just what they call the 22 inch Pro Toolbox. Again, it has the little wire latches with the ability to lock it. Um, again, on the side here, this, this organizer has the latches on there on both sides for that. And on top of the toolbox, there again, it has 
latches to put something else on. Now this one, I'm gonna take it off here so we can get it better. Okay. This one, nice heavy duty handle. Like I said, I've had these about over probably a year and a half or so, and they're real good and sturdy. Like if you can stand on them, sit on them. Again, this has the big wire latches with the padlock key. And this is just, uh, it's got a tray, like a regular toolbox, and then an open bottom. And this is where I keep all my little hand tools, wrenches, pliers, and stuff like that. These are great boxes. I would highly recommend these. I really like these boxes. I've had no issues with them over the time that I've owned them. Uh, again, you can stack them all up, fully loaded down, and they roll well. You know, it's not it's not hard to pull them over, you know, unlevel ground. They work out real well for me. I really have enjoyed these boxes and would like to give me a couple more, if not another set. Now, they sell these in a set with the big box organizer and the toolbox at Home Depot. Um, they sell them separate. And they also have... A little I mean I forget what they call it but it's kind of like a little hamper it's got our crate it's got open sides on it and it doesn't have a lid on it but it all snaps together with this system and I think that'd be good to throw loose tools in and stuff like that okay now the, the one that's like the crate they just call it the pro box and I'll put a picture up of it just in one of the corners here whichever one's got more room after I get to editing and I haven't used one of them I've, I've looked at them in the store thought about buying them a couple of times but haven't decided on picking me one of those or not uh, yet not haven't decided on picking me one of those up yet or not there we go and uh, so this is my little review like I said year and a half strong on the rigid toolbox I guess it would be considered like the pack out set like the other companies call theirs. But um, I've really enjoyed them. And I hope you enjoyed this video. If you enjoyed this video, come back to see us here on R4 Oodles. And to do that, you know, hit the subscribe button if you think we deserve it. Hit that like bell, notification bell for future content, future videos, tool views, DIY. And I hope you come back to see us. You can uh, visit us on Facebook, um, Instagram, and Twitter. And thank you for tuning in to all four oodles and come back to see us. God bless America.